here's this fixture plate that I was working on. It's got that pocket in the back there that was all full of coolant. That pocket took so much work to dig out. See here at the beginning, I don't have to take the chips out of the pocket. There's no pocket yet. They're just getting blown out by the cutter. But later on, even though the face mill is conventional milling, which is like peeling the chips away from the edge as it's cutting rather than trapping them against it, uh, it, it just gets so full of chips that they're getting sucked back into the cutter and I can hear them crunching around in there. And so I got to keep picking it up. When it gets a little deeper, I'm, I'm keep cleaning it out every second lap, like two laps and I clean it out, two laps and I clean it out. And it's only taken half a millimeter per lap. So every single millimeter of steel, I got to stop it, clean it all out and it blow it out and start it again. Stand in there, see here I'm going at it now and it's starting to get deeper, almost an inch deep now. This pocket it goes two inches deep. So that was like half a day standing there, cleaning this damn thing out over and over and over. Look at the wads of chips I'm getting out of it. That's just two laps gives you that many chips. It's just massive the way the steel blows up into this big pile of blown out chips. So here's the other side of the plate. I'll show you this. This is all spot drilling. This is how many features are on the back of this plate. It spot drills for this long. At the very end here, uh, a drill bit comes and starts the first hole. 